Hello, welcome to Lex Nation. Today is going to be a pretty fast one for us. We don't have yeah. a whole lot of announcements. Yeah. It's rare, but it's kind of nice. Yeah, I mean, but one thing it is, it's May 10th. May 10th uh, for the QLAs out there is it's Commission Day. And yes, I love Commission Day. Yes, it's a good day. So happy and so proud of all the hard work that everyone did last month and obviously getting real actual compensation this month. Yes. Now, with May 10th comes something that we announced. Well, it was an incentive for the first quarter of the mm -hmm. year. Mm -hmm. And we announced that if you had six people signed on between January and March, yep. you would earn an extra $250 bonus. Yep. Now, those are paid out today. Yeah. And not just six people. It was six people whose auto ship process. And right. so that's what it took Yes. in order to, to get that extra bonus. And so those all got paid out today. I love that. That's exciting. Hope you, hope you loved your paychecks. That's so <laughs> fun. All right. Also with the month of May, uh, we're already into it. People are already earning Ionix Gold for everyone. Everyone wins. Awesome. Right? So if yes. you're a new enrollee as a new uh, QLA or preferred customer, you're going to get Ionix Gold with your enrollment order. That's right. What is Ionix Gold? It's the fulvic acid product yes. that, we, that we had. It was one of our very first additional products outside of the scanner that we introduced because it's so valuable. It, it conducts energy in and of itself, mm -hmm. and we've shown that before. And you can imprint your gold. Yes, you can. On your scanner. Not only does the new enrollee get it, but every enroller also gets it. The enrollee, you'll get that with your enrollment order. It'll be sent to you. And so if you just enrolled, it's, it's on its way. I hope you enjoy it. All right, and so there's a few of you that are also going to earn, not just a few, there's gonna be many of you that earn several bottles because you enroll several people. We'll send those out at the end of the month. After the month all is over, we're gonna put them all in one big box and send them on to you. Use them however you'd like. If uh, some of you are using them as incentives for others and giveaways, some of you are just stockpiling your, your storage. So That's right. enjoy it. however you like it, enjoy it. Do you know one thing I like about this day? No. Nope. This is the day where we get to show the new ranks that broke from the month before. All right, let's show new ranks. Okay. Congratulations to all of you. That shows a lot of work and effort to be on that list. You know, yeah. that's not just a one-time no. hit. No. You had to maintain those numbers, those recruits, those people on your direct line for three months. Yeah. Well done. Well done. Great consistency all the way through and now recognized, obviously, for the new rank you've achieved. That's right. Now, we also want to recognize our top enrollers and then draw for our contest. So let's do that. Okay. Well, Deb, we are back and we are going to give away some coins to some top enrollers. We're going to draw some names and give away some cool merch, some uh, some bracelets here. Side but before we do that, uh, Kai and Shelby talked about, uh, since it's commission day today, May 10th, um, those that earned the incentive of uh, enrolling six people got a $250 bonus. Yep. And uh, since it's since it's that time of the month, we know who's auto shipped ran. Yep. And we have a list of those that earned that awesome incentive. So should we show them right now? Yeah, let's let's show them. You'll also see it on your paycheck. <laughs> Congratulations uh, to those winners. $250. So many. So many of them. I oh know. my gosh. This, I know. The, the, the type was so small because we had to fit so many people. <laughs> I love on that. There. Great job. We love giving stuff away. Yeah. <laughs> In fact, we're so good at it. Let's do it right now. All right. We have some top enrollers from this last week, May 1st to May 7th. And there is a tie for second place. It is Kim Watkins and Angelique Guidi. Good job, Congratulations. you guys. Great job. You guys keep enrolling. This is awesome. And then we have a three way tie three of them. for wow. top enroller this month. So a coin comes to all three of you. Um, Janine Ridgeway, congratulations. You're one of the coin winners. And, and we have Simmons Holistics. Yes. Great job. Congratulations. And also Belinda Billinghurst. Congratulations again for winning those coins. So great. That's that is five separate people getting on that, you know, top and roller list. I know. That I know. Amazing. They're on fire. We we said that great last job. week. We're not yeah. kidding. You guys really are they on fire. They keep it up every week. I know. I love this. I love this. Let's so keep it awesome. going. 
And we also had a contest. Yes. And this was a follow-up to Deb's call, uh, call from last week. Yes. And it's just uh, what follow-up questions you have for Deb. Yep. And they put them in the comments there, and they get to win what, Deb? What is this? This is win? the Cybin and Tourmaline bracelet. Now, this isn't the beaded one, but this is the banded one that you can also recharge and... My husband actually wears this for oh, his sweet. for his arthritis. Yeah, I wear one every so, day. Yeah, they're great. They're awesome. So we have um, four colors, actually. We have light brown, dark brown, gray, and the black. So if you're a winner, let us know the size and the color you prefer. Otherwise, your winnings is going to just sit on hold. Yeah, yeah. We're just going to wait for you to call. <laughs> so let's, so let's uh, see who wins. Yeah. Do you want to draw first? Yes. All right. This goes to Kylie Van... Clee? Clay? Hmm. Ooh, sorry if I cremated that name. Um, what's one of your favorite detoxes to do and what supports do you add? Mm. Hmm. Detox is a, a whole different oh, section gosh. in and of itself. Yeah. But boy, do we one love a good detox. I yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'd love to hear Deb's answer on that. Yeah, a good detox. Okay. All right. Oh, I got one. All right. Okay. Who's the next winner? Jocelyn Colombe. Nice. All right, Deborah, great info once again. Any recommendations on the frequency of using the three primary scans during pregnancy and for babies? Looking forward to more education. Ooh, great All right, Jocelyn, question. make sure you call in to tell us the size and color you want of your bracelet. And we look forward to hearing those answers. All right, let's do one more. Let's give away those bracelets. These are great, you guys. If you don't have one, Seriously. I, I strongly recommend. Um, at least trying them, because I, I actually love these bracelets. Okay, this is Heather Lambias. I haven't been able to find the detox frequency for all the miasms. Why are they not available? Hmm. hmm. You may want to let us know which ones are not available, because yeah. that's And a I know question. Deb, yeah, and Deb, uh, Deb's an expert on miasms. And yes. during Day of Discovery, just we had, uh, what, two months ago about Yes, wow, it's yes. it's already been two months. Um, she taught her whole presentation was miasms. Yes. So yes. that's a good question to ask her. Yes. And so. maybe to ask Lauren and maybe we start needed to add more to the We're going to gonna the, get, to we're gonna get educated. Yep. I love this. <laughs> yeah, these questions are good for all of us. We all get to learn when you ask questions. So thank, keep the questions yeah, thank coming. Thank you so much. So anyway, congratulations Congrats. to all our winners. Yep. On with the call. Yeah. Well, let's start with quick scan today. Quick scan is your very top scan on your scanner. And it's just like the, the name implies. It's quick. It's not going to give you a full scan, but it's going to give you enough information in the morning when you're really in a rush to get going and get out there. So let's let's take a look at that real quick. So if you open up your, your screen, as you can see here, so when you click on the quick scan tab at the very top of your screen, it'll bring up your menu. Now you'll see there's a lot of things on here other than just the quick scan, and we're gonna go through some of those in a minute. Now, if this is the first time you're using uh, your phone, your first time you've set it up, it'll come up and prompt you to allow the microphone and allow the camera to function. And you're gonna to wanna to approve those so that when you go forward, that won't ever come up again, but it needs your voice, uh, it needs the microphone for your voice, and it needs the camera when you're taking uh, pictures. Okay, so we're going to assume that that's done. You come up and you hit morning AM. Now here it's telling me on this screen, as you can see, that there's no supplements loaded. And that's because this is a brand new device. On your device, you're going to want to take the time to put your supplements in. And there's a video that will show you how to do that. So the next thing you do, you get yourself composed, drink some water, and then you hit next. And now it's going to ask you, to record your voice. Now, if you look at this button, on the record button, on the left of the word record, there's a little microphone. On the right of the word record, there's a little heart. That means that this is not only gonna do your voice, it's also gonna do a uh, simple but quick uh, vital scan. Not a complete of everything, but enough of your vitals to give you, you know, where you should start with today. So just before you hit the record button, this is the time you're going to want to put on your bone conducting headset and make sure that they're positioned so that the coil is right on the bone in front of your ear. Okay, so we bring the phone, your device up to your mouth. You push the record button. I am Lauren Swenson, and this is a demonstration of QuickScan. 
It's going to record my voice for 10 seconds, and that's all it needs. Now, as you can see, the scan is finished in 10 seconds. The most important part of that was I am. I am and then your name. That's the most important thing because that validates you. That validates your vocal cords. Everything is ready for your true emotional state to be recorded. Now it comes up and it will show you on the screen two colors. Now in inner voice, we're actually looking at four frequencies. The three frequencies that are way high above um, your baseline and the one frequency that is below your baseline, your lowest frequency. In here on the quick scan, all we're gonna focus on is the highest one and the lowest one. The highest one, it represents the emotion that we're overcompensating for. The lowest one represents the emotion that we're bearing. And a lot of times we're not even aware of that emotion. It can be all the way from something back when you were in the womb or a small child. But that particular emotion is the one that causes probably the most grief in our life. What it's showing you here is if you're going to use your light wave gla glasses or your colored glasses, you're going to want to wear the yellow one in this case and the orange one. Okay, those are your high and your low. And then it's going to, down right below play, it says right here, no or top supplements. We didn't have any supplements loaded in my library, so there was nothing for there to go and analyze. So it just says top supplements and it's empty. But here I'd make sure now that my headphones are ready, I'd hit play and the appropriate piece of music with the appropriate frequencies that I need to hear are gonna be played. And this one here is the frequency that represents the lowest frequency. So what's behind this music is the frequencies for my buried emotion, okay? Now this will play for that three minutes and you're done. That's how fast, that's how fast quick scan is. Just like the name says, it's quick. You go in, you get yourself ready, get your thoughts ready, make sure everything is set, record 10 seconds of your voice. And right after that, it's gonna let you know what supplements you need right now, according to your, your frequencies in your body, and the two uh, glasses that you'd wanna spend 15 minutes each uh, viewing through. And it's done. Now that's just the first part of quick scan. Let's reopen quick scan again. If you'll notice below the scanning part, there's one that says custom. So now custom scan is not tied to AM, PM or afternoon. It doesn't matter what time of the day or night you do that. It's specifically to scan when you feel like you just need a scan. Um, and when you do an AM, an afternoon or a, an evening scan, it's only going to scan the supplements in your library that are in those categories, AM, afternoon, and, and PM. On a custom scan, it's going to scan your whole supplement library because it's not tied to one of those three segments. So that's what custom scan is for. A great, a great resource to use. It's also where you have your pets. If you click on pets, this is where you can now scan your pet as a quick scan. And under there, you'll see underneath the, uh, my name, there's a little box that says scan target. That's where your pet, and you would click on that, it would list the pets that you have listed. If you have multiple uh, cats and dogs or birds or whatever, you would pick the, the pet that you wanna work with and do a quick scan on them. This is a great function for those of you who are have a lot of furry kids. Okay, so let's go back to quick scan again. Underneath pets, there's energetic auras. Now, the two in here that we're focusing on are clearing, clearing the energies around us, clearing the, the energies that we've accumulated, or maybe we've had you know, some bad feelings, and then shield. This is important when you're dealing with clients. When you're dealing with other people, you don't want their energies, their frequencies to affect yours. So the first thing you would do is sit down and clear yourself, and then you would shield yourself. And each one of those takes 20 seconds. Now it's important to know that when you click either clearing or shield, it won't go to another screen. It will just begin to play a, a frequency, and that frequency lasts 20 seconds. The clearing one is a very specific matrix of frequencies that just kind of neutralizes the energies or the frequencies that are not inherently ours. 
doesn't do anything to your own frequencies. It just gets rid of those that we've collected. Um, and then shield is kind of an energetic barrier that it puts around us. Now this sounds a little strange and for first time users in frequencies, this sounds really out there. But if you think about it, you've gone to places where you feel comfortable, you've gone to places where you don't feel comfortable and it's the energies there. All we're wanting to do is give you the ability to put your state, your mind in the, or your physical being in the best frequency state possible to uh, either scan somebody or even scan yourself. So they won't go to another screen. They'll just play for those 20 seconds and they're done. And if you're doing multiple uh, clients through the day or you're scanning yourself multiple times during the day, it's recommended to do a clearing and then do a shield and then do your scan, okay? Below that is three minute boost. I love the three minute boost. Back in the 80s, I was introduced to an audio program called Supercharger. And it was a, freak, a set of frequencies that you listen to for 30 minutes through headphones. Uh, it couldn't be listened to on a speaker. It had to be through headphones. And the first time I experienced that, I was blown away. I went to the most amazing mental space in my mind. I was When it was done, my mind was clear. I was sharp. And I was energized. Supercharger is like that. It's obviously 30 years later, so the technology is much, much more fine tuned and, and uh, detailed. But that three minutes, you listen to that three minutes with headphones, and you will see that your brain is clearer and sharper, and you're you're just fine tuned. The one right below that is focus. Same thing, it's a set of or matrix of frequencies that are geared to bring the brainwave activity down into the theta, high theta, low alpha state where you're not sleeping, you're not whatever, but it's you're receptive to inspiration and you're creative at the same time. Relax is one of those things that you would do like if you were trying to do meditation. Now, each one of these boosts is only three minutes long. They don't take a lot of time. But if you're gonna do any one of these things where you wanna just see your head together, you wanna to become more creative, you wanna relax, you wanna do some uh, neuro exercising or just ground yourself, it only takes three minutes to get your frequencies ready for that activity. So relaxation will bring you down into a meditative state. Grounding is one of those things when you just kinda, you just can't seem to get in sync with, with your day, activities just aren't going the way they need to, take three minutes, sit down, drink some water, and listen to grounding. And it'll just help you settle down emotionally and mentally in your brain. Neuroaerobics is very similar to supercharge in the sense that it's going to stimulate the brain. But it's more like, just like the name says, it's more like doing aerobics in the brain. The the sounds, the frequencies behind there are just snap, 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 getting your, your synapses to fire. Different from supercharger, but in the same, the same vein. So quick charge or uh, quick scan gives you lots of op uh, options and is probably one of the uh, areas of the scanner that people don't realize and utilize as much as they could. So take the time to play with quick scan. Do your quick scans in the morning when you're in a hurry. At least once or twice a week, do the full vital scan, the full comprehensive, the full inner voice. When you're in a hurry, the quick scan is just really great to do. And then use your boost uh, throughout the day as you're going through things. We're gonna jump into easy scan now. Easy scan is another one of those when you're in a hurry, you don't have the time to really do the full scan, kind of like quick scan. Quick scan's only, you know, less than a minute to do. Easy scan takes about six minutes, maybe a little bit more, a little bit less, depending on how many of your frequencies are out of balance. But if we click on easy scan, it brings up uh, your, your main screen here. Now, I've already done the scan so that we don't sit here for six minutes. So I'm gonna be able to go through it through each part of it and then just show you the reports. And this is the main difference between easy scan and then doing a full vitals, comprehensive and vitals. So three steps, inner voice, and when you click to start the scan, again, this will also, if you've got supplements in your library, it will go and scan 
your library and it's going to scan the library based on the time of day you do this. So if you're doing this easy scan in the morning, it's going to scan your AM section of your library. If you're doing it in the afternoon, it's going to be the afternoon section, the evening, the evening. It does not do a custom. So easy scan will based on the time that's on your phone, if it's morning, afternoon or evening, it will pick from that part of your library. So keep that in mind. When I start and I hit scan, you'll see it go through inner voice and the, there will be a little green bar that travels across. And it takes about two minutes approximately on each one of these to go across. When that finishes with inner voice, now you're, again, you're gonna have to do your inner voice, I am, remember the I am. When that finishes, it will automatically go to step two, which is your vitals. It'll do a vital scan and a vitals optimization. You'll see the little green bar going across as it's doing the scan. And it's always best to have your, fed, your headphones on, your bone conductor headphones on when you're doing the scan. Best to put it on right when you start. And when vital scan and optimize ends, it will automatically go to step three, which is your comprehensive scan and optimization. Now the difference here is it did scan those, it scanned all of them. What it's gonna do though in your reports is where it's different. It will come up at the end and show you the supplements that it recommends that you take. So when the easy scan is finished, it will immediately give you the option to pick either enhanced reports or classic reports. Right now I'm gonna show you the classic report, but you can always go back up and toggle between the two. The difference between the reports from easy scan and doing a regular vitals, a regular inner voice, or a regular comprehensive is the amount of data the report's going to give you. Now, if you'll notice here on the on the uh, inner voice, you're seeing the, the Pulse version, which is the enhanced version. It shows you which glasses that you're going to want to wear, uh, you know, your two tops, not all four. And then it gives you the button to push for play to listen to those, those tones. It'll also list your supplements if you have supplements in your library. Then it will jump right into your vitals report. At the beginning, it gives you the little legend of what the want the numbers mean. And it'll show you uh, anything that was either a one or a two or an eight or a nine. The ones that are the first, furthest out of range. It will not show you everything else in between. So it makes the test much faster and your report much easier to, to, to email and read. So you can just see, okay, I need to pay attention to these items, okay? So you'll notice you went right through those, your bloods, there was only two items in the whole blood panel. The chakras, the meridians, still gives you the information. But now I'm already at the bottom of that report. Now I'm jumping right into comprehensive. And in comprehensive, there was nothing that came up that was either a one, two, or an eight or a nine. So see how fast and simple it's just, it's the reader's digest version of your report. Now, if that's too much information, you can go back and toggle to the classic report. And as that populates, it shows you the old inner voice with your graphs. It will show you the two colors that you need for glasses, allow you to play. But instead of giving you a one or a two or an eight or a nine, it'll just show you the reds, the things that did not change. So if it was a nine and it was still a nine after optimization, those are the only things, or a one, those are the only things it'll show you. And so your reports are very quick, very simple, and it's very fast to see where you are and the things you need to focus on right now. So that is the easy scan. So we're going to talk about how to load your supplement library. And for those of you who are new to this, this is probably one of the most cost beneficial things you can do to your scanner because it's going to help you understand what supplements that resonate with you every day and throughout the day and help you save money on not taking supplements you don't necessarily need. Even though our bottles will say one a day or twice uh, you know, every day or twice every, every other day, this is gonna show you the, the vitamin or the supplements that are in your library, that their frequencies resonate with what you need right now. And so you may not need the same supplement every single day. So let's go through that. First thing to do is go up to your profile Open up profile, drops down the menu. The very first button is supplements slash therapies. When you open that up, it will load up and it comes up with 
you'll notice right at the top, supplements, therapies, and then there's a little picture of a person, and then the little blue box, that's your specifics, and then a green box, which is your, gen your general library. These are your libraries. We're gonna start right underneath because I have no supplements in here. You click on the little plus, no supplements, and it brings up your supplement page. Now this isn't hard, don't let it overwhelm you. This is really quite simple. Have your supplements ready. Have them on your table, on your countertop. Set your device down on a flat surface so you can work. And you're gonna need a couple shot glasses, one for dry and one for liquid, okay? So let's just say that we're going to um, load Prime into your, your library. Right where it says uh, name, you'd click on there and you'd just write in Prime, P-R-I-M-E, okay? Now, Prime is going to be a morning and an evening supplement. So I'm going to set both of those. See, so if I'm scanning during the morning, it will look to see if I need Prime, and it will also do the same in the evening. Okay, so once we've decided if it's a morning, an afternoon, an evening, or both, then it asks for the description. Now, on Prime, Prime is a cellular daily cellular nutrition supplement. So in there, I'd put in cellular Nutrition. Now this is just for you or for whoever's doing the scan to know it, uh, what it is. It's, it has nothing to do with how it's gonna be scanned in. It's just to let you know. Now it's asking me what my dose quantity is. On the label, it says two capsules. So I'm gonna put two. And then right next to it says unspecified. That means what is it? Is it a capsule, a tablet, a liquid? These are capsules, so I'm gonna click on the capsule. So now I've, I've just to recap, I've named it, I've uh, identified when I want it to scan, I've given me a description so when it comes up, I know immediately what it is, how many I need to take, and what type of a supplement it is, a capsule. Once that's done, the next thing you need to do is take a little vial, put it on your screen, put two capsules in the, in the little shot glass and hit scan, the little green button on the bottom. When that happens, you'll see a little video come up and it's scanning the frequencies of those, sub, those two capsules. Now this is important. You would not put the whole bottle of Prime or any other supplement on there because I'd be like taking the whole bottle. You only wanna scan what the dose is for each time you take that supplement. Once that's done, you hit save and it's done. And now you just go to your next supplement. And you'll notice now, if we go back to your main page, it shows I have prime cellular nutrition, two capsules, and it's already loaded in and it's already been identified. It's gonna be in a morning and an evening scan. And you're gonna go through that with every single one of your supplements. Now, if the supplement isn't necessarily tied to a period or time of the day, then you just, it's general. You don't have to put it in, it's just a general time. But that's how you load your, your supplements. It's easy. Once you have all your supplements together, it goes real quick. Just remember, you're scanning a dose, not the whole bottle. Give it the, the, the description, what it is, and where it needs to be scanned. Once you build that library, that is invaluable. So I've just showed you how to put your own supplements in. And that's really important because there's gonna be a lot of supplements that you have that others don't have. So you wanna customize this to the supplements that you take. But let me show you what's already in there for you and how to access them. If you go back up to the top, where it says supplements and therapies, you have three little buttons, the pink one, the, the person, then you have a blue button, and over to the right, you have a green one. If I push on the blue one, it shows you all the supplements that I have scanned into the, the device, okay? They're all right there for me. But if you'll notice down at the bottom, it's the add to client is grayed out. Until I check one, it won't allow me to add it to the client, which means if you're dealing with your family, so you've got you, your spouse, your children, every one of their profiles is gonna access the library differently because you're gonna set these supplements up to be customized to each, each person. Or if you're a practitioner, you're gonna be able to do this with all your clients. So every client that you come in, 
is going to have a different scan library. Okay. So if you don't want that in for that client, you just take the X out. The other thing is if you hit the green button, all of our homeopathics and some of the Solex products are already listed for you. But you notice they're not coming up in the scans. When we did the scans a few minutes ago, there was no supplement that came up because we had not identified them to be part of my scan. Well, here's what I can do here. So I come down and I hit group by category and it tells me evening, general, or morning. If I now click on evening, it shows me that the only one that's listed there is X because that's in my, my general library. That's the only one that was specifically for evening. But if I don't click the box, I can't add it to my scan. And when I do that, now every time I do an evening scan, it will scan to see if X comes up for me, okay? If I go back to that, uh, here's my evening and my morning scans. Those are the ones that, are, that have been identified. So as you can see, your, your device comes with the homeopathics, the homeoenergetics, and some of the Solex products already built in but not in an area where we're forcing you to scan them. You still have the ability to add them to your scan or to your client scan. And then you can add all the other ones you want. This is an amazing tool. It's like a, having your own homeopathic practitioner and health store right in, your, in the palm of your hands. So play with your, your, your uh, supplement library. There's one other thing you can do that we haven't really talked about that is therapies. So let's go back to ungroup. We hit plus sign. We want to add a therapy. Maybe you're a Reiki master. Maybe you do yoga. Maybe you do acupuncture or you have a clinic and you use hyperbaric or theta chambers. You can now add those in as a therapy. So let's say I'm going to do uh, acupuncture. I put that in. And I'm going to do, put that down under therapies. And I put down here, just put in acupuncture. There is no dose. It's unspecified. I would just go down and hit scan. Now, there's nothing to put on here. It's going basically on what you put up in the name attached to the therapy. Okay? And it will scan that. So if you're scanning through the middle of the day and it comes up and says, you need some acupuncture or you need some uh, meditation, that's where it comes. So it's not just your supplements, but also your therapies. So till next time. Lauren, great job. Great instruction today. Thanks. Well done teaching us about quick scan and easy scan. I think we need to do a, uh, an end with quick scan and easy scan. I think it'd be helpful if they could tell us what they learned that they didn't know before. Yeah with quick scan and easy scan, and maybe which one they're more comfortable with. Yeah, I love that, I love that. So comment on this call, what part of quick scan or easy scan did you learn something new about, and which, or which part, uh, which one do you use the most? That's right. How about that? Let's give away X. We good, haven't given away X in a while, so we're gonna give away X to, next week to three people when we read your comments here on this call. So have a great week. All right, um, I don't know what we're talking about next. Deb, we're back and we're gonna give away stuff. We're going, well, it's, okay. <laughs> Try again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Congratulations again for winning a, a Solex, um. <laughs> <laughs> okay, try again. Uh, little history on this. Back in the early 80s, I was introduced to a audio program called, um, I can't remember what it was called. Back in the 80s, I was introduced to a program called Tap Guidance or Basic Reports. My word. <laughs> I'm going to go home and cry. I know. You know I, this, right? I, already go home and sleep. <laughs> I would love to go home and sleep. <laughs>